campers, hello, welcome to this time of camp. We're happy to have. Oh, <clears throat> my bad. Campers, hello, welcome to have you. Yeah, here, woohoo. To my right, I have Harry Pitts. Great guy, nice to have you here, Harry. Thank you, sir. To my left, we have Dilvon Troy. Happy to have you here, Dilvon. I happy to be here. Thank you, Dilvon. Obviously, to my satisfaction and happiness, our last uh, cohort and host, James, has been replaced with the two of these folks, and I'm very happy about it, if you know why. Today's story that we are talking about is Jonah. Jonah and the Whale, everybody! Here we go! This is going to be a good one right here. Have you heard of Jonah and the Whale? Yes, yes. Okay. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead and tell the story. Anyway, so the story starts off with Jonah getting a message from God. Jonah, it's me, the Lord. Lord? Is that you? Yes. Jonah, I have a task for you. I need you to bounce out of here, head down to Nineveh, and preach to them and tell them that my wrath is going to be poured out against them unless they repent. This way, Lord, right? No, this, no. Jo Jonah, you're way. in the wrong... Jonah! Okay, Jonah, you're, it's the other way, Jonah. See you, Lord. No, Jonah, but what, what are you doing? After the message from God, Jonah decided he really wasn't too fond of that due to his fear. The Lord's a meanie head. I want to go swimming. So, for Jonah, his decision was to, instead of going to Nineveh, to go to Tarshish. Once at the dock, he was then able to board his boat. No, no, it was a raft. A little floatable raft. Uh, what do you use for the ocean? Uh, I'm sorry? Yeah, it was. it's in the Bible. The floatable raft. There was no floatable raft. <laughs> it was a floatable raft. No, it was a boat. It was the floatable raft. Oh, no, not this again. Okay, uh, where in the Bible was it a floatable raft? Literally, in the story. Where in the story? Did you not read it? I did, it's a boat! What version are you reading again? Not the message! It says it in the kitchen. Just like James. My word, Delvon, help me out here. I happy be here. The floatable raft. Continue on. In the ocean. Okay. So as he docks his floatable raft. Thank you. And boards to sea. God had a different plan. See. God was angry with Jonah for not wanting to go to Nineveh. So, because of that, he sent a horrible storm. Moderate storm. It, no, it was horrible. It was pretty moderate. It was, just like an average storm no, just coming no, around. I'm, I'm pretty died. sure it said moderate. It they, was just him, though, and he didn't die. It, it so wasn't it was just moderate. him. It was, there was a whole How was more than he one was, person going to fit in the raft? It wasn't a raft. It was the inflatable, and there's only one person for it. It was a boat. Did you not read it in the box? I, the box? Yeah. What box? <laughs> It's in the Bible, not the box. Yeah, well, the box for the raft, and then you have to read it one person in a cup order. Plastic wasn't even around back it then. It was definitely around in this one. Just go on. I'm trying to set you straight here. Delavon, help me out here again, please. I happy. Anything else, Delavon? To be here. Thank you, Delavon. Oh, we'll anyway, after the storm. Moderate. Jonah knew what he had to do, that being to, in order to save the rest of the crew, jump out of the boat. Inflatable. Boat. With him. Yep, just the inflatable. Just jumping out. Go ahead. You're doing a great job. Yeah. Directors, I'm going to have your neck. <laughs> anyway. So once out of the boat, Jonah was then swallowed by a very large fish. Wait, 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 what was that? Wait, is that RKO out of nowhere? The fish are here. Didn't you see that in the story? What? An RK you know what an RKO is? Yeah? Yeah, that's what happened. Hey, I'm like, no, what? what? Yeah, it, the fish no, literally he got came out of the water, RKO'd him what into think, the water. John Cena over here? That's Randy Orton, but it's close enough. Oh, oh my. Yeah. Could, I no, mean, no. John Cena, Randy Orton, like, no, yeah, it, no. no. RKO. No, he, he, was Bam. he was swallowed by yeah, a big fish. Yeah, after the RKO. There was no RKO. They had, how else is he going to go underwater? He jumped! RKO. RKO. He was jumping off the boat, RKO. Jumped out of the boat. Yeah, RKO. The fish it was waiting. RKO. It was pfft, RKO. Continue Come on. I happy to be here. Yeah, he's not that good. 
Anyway. After the RKO. After swallowed by the fish. RKO. Jonah so happened to be in the belly of the whale for three days. Three and a half. Three days. There's the half day. You need to he show, had to fast for that other half. Stop. Um, okay. Apparently, you're not reading the right Bible. No, you're not. Uh, you, you must have missed that part. Like you're getting fired. At <laughs> Once in the belly of the whale, he was then praying to God for three days. And a half. For which God heard his prayers and allowed him to be spat out by the whale. It wasn't really like a spat out. It was kind of like a slight, like, he just kind of walked out. Yeah, we don't do no, the whole yeah. violent thing. It's just 2020. We don't do violence here. What do you think this is? Yeah, well, this is, I mean, but the RK is not that violent, because you got RK. <laughs> but spatting out to the land, that seems kind of hurtful. <laughs> Where did he get it go? <laughs> Who is this guy? You okay, Dolph? I'm happy. To be here. Okay, he's happy. All right. All right. All right. Yeah, there we go. Just, let me just, uh, move this thing around. Anyway, mm -hmm. yeah. after being on the land, after walking jo out of the mouth, Jonah decided to go home to Nineveh. Where Great place. Did. Actually, it wasn't. Well, I mean, it was all right. No, it's it kind of like Las Vegas, but better. No, no, it was worse than Las Vegas. Yeah, was it though? Yes. Oh, come on. There? Kind of. How is it? said it in the Bible. It said equivalent to Las Vegas. No, it did. <laughs> in parentheses, right after Nineveh. Equivalent to Las Vegas. Are you reading on your stinking iPhone? It's possible, yeah. <laughs> it's the hipster version. <laughs> Delavant, he's crazy. Ugh. Be happy. Don't, don't, no, don't. Thank, hey, you thank you. Different. Be happy to be. Yeah, yeah, we, we, we get it. Get it. He's getting fired. <sighs> so are you. I don't know about that yet. Continue on with uh, Nineveh. Yeah, after age. preaching, after going to Nineveh, he then preached to the Ninevites, where he then... At Caesar's Palace. That's, yeah, Caesar's Palace. That's, 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 yeah, yeah, well, it's like equivalent to Caesar's Palace. It's also in the Bible. No, it's not. It, it's right. No, I'm, stop. Please. Okay. I'm just trying to get through this video. We're almost done. Thank God. Literally, thank God. Then that's, uh, then that's what the, the people of Nineveh were doing, thanking God for not showing his wrath on them and providing them with a second chance. And safe spaces. And social distancing? And social distancing, yeah. Uh, At least six and a half feet. We gotta go that extra half, because Las Vegas, you never and know. Three and a half days, yeah, yeah. yeah. Three and a half days. And that's the story of Jonah. And the whale. Director! You can't forget about Get the whale! Get rid of these people! You forgot about the whale! Up. He has a right! I'm happy to be here.